Hey everyone, in this video we're going to make one of my favorite dishes, steamed Chinese style pork hash. And it's really simple to do, but the payout is awesome. So we start with just ground pork and we're adding, you know, shoyu and oyster sauce. We're going to put in some uh, ginger and garlic and then we're going to add green onions. And then we're adding water chestnuts. Once we get that in, we're also going to add some egg. Once all that's together, we'll go ahead and mix it. And you want to make sure it's all evenly blended in. Now, the interesting thing or the fun thing about this mix here is you can steam it like we're, what we're going to do here, but this is also the same mix you could use to make wontons or you can make pot stickers or you can make shumai with. So it's very versatile. Um, we're putting it into a nice, uh, you know, a steam proof bowl. And what I'm doing here is I'm really, I'm trying to shape it so it looks neat, but I'm also going to uh, sort of put an inverted dome in the bottom. And the reason why I'm doing that is I'm trying to create a very even layer of the ground pork in the bowl so that it steams evenly. Go ahead and put it into a pot that's already, you know, got some steam going. And then we're gonna cover it and let it do its thing. Once the pork hash is done steaming, you're gonna to wanna to scoop off this sediment of albumin that comes to the top from the steaming. Just take a spoon and scoop it off and it comes off nice and easy. When you've cleaned that off, we're just gonna go ahead and garnish it with a little bit of green onions. If you like cilantro, that's another great garnish. You know, take a, take a bunch of sprigs and throw that on top. It looks great, tastes great. And there it is, real simple dish. So here we have our Chinese style pork hash and this is one of those dishes that my mom used to make for me when I was younger. And it really brings back memories. Um, you know, she'd make it, we'd have for dinner. And the best part that I used to enjoy was leftovers because then, you know, she'd make a little like a, a packed lunch where it had a little piece of this and some rice and stuff and it's the perfect lunch item. But uh, the other thing we used to do is we would eat it with manua lettuce leaves. And if you don't have manua lettuce leaves, you can use butter lettuce, but it's really the, the, the crispness of the lettuce uh, really kind of lightens up the dish and makes it really, really refreshing. So we would put a little bit of uh, the pork hash in, a little shoyu, and uh, these days I'm putting a little bit of sriracha. It's really, really good. Can't wait to get in this bad boy, but before I do, don't forget, for more recipes like this, visit us at foodland.com. Mm. Mm.